So just things to keep in mind. Unfortunately, there's not a silver bullet uh, for recommending the right type of data collection or the right evaluation design. It really is context dependent. And think about, you know, we said before, if you're doing a grant for $250 versus $250,000, those are very different grants. Um, and so what you're asking in terms of the information up front as well as the evaluative information at the end of that grant looks vastly different. Um, there's no way you can expect to accomplish the same scope of, of work, so you shouldn't necessarily ask the same level of evaluation questions. So this idea of right-sizing is really important both for the design as well as for the data that's being collected. Um, evaluation designs are not one-size-fits-all. There are times when one, of, one design is probably more appropriate than another design, and this is uh, where an evaluator either within your organization or a consultant can be really helpful. Um, and bringing their experience of which designs work well in which situations. Um, and just really hitting home this idea that you really need to consider kind of the whole scope of the evaluation. What is it that you're hoping to learn from the evaluation? What are the resources you and the grantee organization have for the evaluation? What is the timeline? Um, and what is the scope of work? And then, you know, picking a design uh, that fits with that, those 